what it is what's up you guys i had to redo this intro because this video has taken me months to do and it somehow got lost it got deleted i don't know what happened to it but yeah pretty much this is going to be a room makeover it's less of a transformation and more of just like a little makeover just for like organization purposes i do live in a small three bedroom apartment in brooklyn so you gotta make do with what you have oh my god i forgot to tell you guys i'm blonde now <laughs> It's funny because this video took me so long to make so you'll see me like literally transform like I had black hair then brown hair now blonde hair Sorry, the timeline of this video is kind of confusing really wanted to focus on organization space efficiency I definitely want to add more to it later on But I feel like for now we're off to a good start and I also noticed I wore the same Shirt for the majority of the video because I guys have that like go-to comfy pajama top that you just like grab every time It's clean and you just like constantly wear it was clean it didn't stink and i definitely did not stink either because this video is sponsored by native if y'all don't know what native is i have some of their products right here girl native has a range of products to keep you smelling good all day they also have what's called their best sellers pack so you can enjoy every part of your shower routine with their body wash deodorant and their deodorant body spray their products are clean simple and effective y'all plus they have so many scents to choose from whatever combination of smells you can think of they probably have it and they also have limited edition scents that are dropping all the time so i did get all different scents just because i really wanted to try all of them so this first one i got is cherry and vanilla macaron i didn't know if it was macaron or macaroon i tried to look it up and it said it was macaron so so this one is a very very sweet and fruity kind of smell i definitely smell the cherry in it more then i got the sweet peach and next this is their deodorant this one smells so good this one's definitely more of a subtle smell but i definitely smell the peach in it which gives it more of like a summertime vibe lastly i got lilac and white tea and this one this one is more of like a calm smell it's definitely giving more floral but this one might be my favorite this one smells really good and it just has like a really like clean smell like oh it smells so good i love the deodorant and body spray because you can like carry it in your bag in case you need a little like you know freshen up the application is light as air it's like a cooling light mist and it dries on contact so you don't have that like nasty like wet feeling under your arms you know so it leaves you smelling great and feeling fresh it's easy to apply it provides instant odor protection and it doubles as an overall fragrance spray like guys I literally smell so good right now doesn't leave yellow stains on clothing and it's made with just six ingredients including nitrogen which is an ozone friendly natural propellant it's also aluminum paraben and hydrocarbon propellant free it is also vegan and cruelty free and it uses denatured alcohol made from corn to dry quickly and fight odor y'all can get your best sellers pack today you know freshen up your routine for the new season it's normally $36 but if you use my link and code stephanie2 y'all can get your deodorant body wash and deodorant body spray for only $24 that's 33% off y'all definitely check that link in my description shout out to native for sponsoring this video and let's get back into it okay baby so i was organizing my closet a little bit and i put in these shoe boxes kind of it helped me organize a bunch i ran out of shoe boxes so i had to order more as you can see i still have a bunch of like boxes and like loose shoes and stuff so i wanted to like organize it a little bit better so i did order more of these shoe boxes and they came in i got them off amazon they come in a pack like this so i'm gonna show you guys how i put them together finish organizing my closet put all the shoes away and hopefully it will look a lot better
So to start off, I reorganized all the shoe boxes already in my closet and I was able to get rid of some of the bulkier boxes by using these organizers. So this is how it ended up looking. Then I got my sister's boyfriend to put my curtain up and it had to be pink, of course. Okay guys, so I'm getting things done in my room little by little. I still have to get a few more things in the mail, but I just thought this would be fun to do on camera. So I have my subscriber plaque, which I got, I don't know, like a year or two ago. No, I definitely was living at my mom's house still so like three years ago but it got fucked up in the mail let me see if i can show you guys can you see how badly it was scratched like i guess i didn't pack it well or something loud ass cars outside so bad and that just makes me like really upset so that's why i have never like put it up on my wall or anything so i thought i would just like decorate it with some cute little stickers <laughs> some cute little hello kitty stickers i'm gonna try to like hide the scratches we're gonna do it together It'll hopefully make it like look prettier Hey baby, so surprise, I dyed my hair. So I got a new clothes rack. She's sitting right here, right outside my room. And she's huge, okay? She's a big girl. She's gonna take up the whole wall space because it's always been my dream to have like a walk-in closet. And that's not gonna happen. So I'm making my room a walk-in closet. You know what I mean? And it's gonna be cute, it's gonna be a vibe. And I can put all my clothes on there. It's gonna make life so much easier. It's gonna be so much easier to pick outfits. Also so sorry I look dusty like it's hot outside y'all and I was outside all morning but um it's gonna be so much easier to pick outfits because right now everything's just all over the place girl like let me show you girl I have no system no order in this room right now so we have this clothes rack and it, this one's really small and tiny because my old room was so small so that's why we have this little baby right here and it's just like a mess and I have all my shirts down here and shoes every time I want to look for something I have to take everything out like it's just not it's not a good system and on the other side it's just a blank wall and then this is always a mess so this is kind of like my accessories corner that box don't even been, oh my god don't even get me started on this box girl i've been trying to sell this clothes for months and they just keep accumulating and building up so yeah like this is the room before okay this is gonna be the before shot and then in the end you're gonna see the after oh my god girl i have such a cute vision for my room i have a whole mood board on pinterest i have a vision so today i'm just going to declutter all the shit that i don't want that i want to sell you know kind of organize Okay, babies, it's a big day. I got my clothes rack and I'm going to attempt to build it by myself. I've never built anything in my life. I'm like, I'm a lazy bitch. So I feel like this is a big project for just one person, but I think I'm gonna be really happy with it. Let me go grab it. My clothes rack came in. I got this bitch on Amazon and it was dumb cheap, which is why I got it. I feel like I'm talking a lot. I had a coffee, so I'm like, Girl, I'm, about, I'm like sweating, but we're gonna try it. We are strong, independent women out here, and we're gonna do our best. So, I feel like it can't be that hard. Also, do you guys like my new hair color? I don't know how I feel about it. Oh my gosh, she did that. I almost broke two nails off. Like this finger is like literally throbbing because I like bent it back and now it hurts so bad. But it's fine because she's done. She's huge. Like this is a lot bigger 
than I thought it was gonna be in my room like it's really like tall i'm going to get rid of this clothes rack so i'm gonna start putting everything from there on here i'm just like proud of myself like what per like i never built anything in my life y'all wow i'm really that girl i really built that like that's crazy I worked on my clothes rack for a few hours actually. I know it seemed really quick, but low key it took forever. And then I got some new sheets and a cover for my bed because I wanted to have more of like a clean look. And of course I had to add my plush sheets. I got this body pillow. Look how cute it is. His little tongue is sticking out. Okay, babies. So it is now the next day and ah, I got my shelves up. My sister's boyfriend actually ended up putting them up for me. And let me show you that. They're just like these floating shelves. Girl, I can't even reach this. So I think for today I'm going to organize those shelves and I want to put these LED lights up I have two packs of these and I want to put them around my clothes rack and probably around my desk as well which is like a complete mess right now so i think i just want to like work on my room today so far i do like how it's coming out i feel like it feels really clean and organized in here which is what i wanted so so far so good and we're gonna keep going Hey babies so i'm breaking out but i wanted to film this real quick so i found like a little hack on tiktok that said you could print posters from fedex for like the low so i want to get some posters up in my room like i think i'm gonna put them like right here in this wall i just want to show you guys i'm on the fedex website i'm just gonna try these three picks that i got from pinterest they're right here it says estimated total four dollars girl we about to see i don't know if they're gonna be blurry or mad small or like crusty i don't know so i'm like let me try these out and if i like them i'll order more also i'm wearing blue light glasses because i be getting headaches when i'm on my laptop for so long yeah i'm gonna keep you guys posted and let you know when the posters come in so hopefully it looks cute and i can put them up okay guys so i was gonna just start with the three girl i got them all i got like 10 posters because the shipping was ten dollars so i was like okay i'm not gonna keep paying this ten dollars so i was like let me just get them all at the same time also it's raining outside i don't know if you guys hear the thunder guys yeah, so my order was submitted so now i just wait for my posters to come in guys the posters came in <laughs> they're so bad they're so bad do y'all see this i feel like it looks fine on camera but it's like so blurry in real life like look at this face it's so blurry and pixelated bitch <laughs> but i'm gonna still put them up anyway i'm like oh well i feel like they still look cool and i feel like on the wall like from a distance you can't tell okay from a distance and when you squint your eyes they're not gonna be able to tell i still feel like they look cool though so i'm happy bitch i only spent eight dollars on all these so and i also got these hooks so i'm gonna put all my skirts on these because they have like the little clippies okay guys i also got this poster from like an actual store like in the mall it's a sailor moon poster like i honestly don't know where to put this this one's a lot bigger than the other ones like this shit is fucking huge so this one's undecided yet i had to cut the edges off the pages so they look like actual posters instead of prints and i wanted to arrange them in a cute way and pretty much i just stuck them on with tape We have a special guest in the vlog, y'all. My dad pulled up to mount the TV. He was getting so pissed off because it wasn't coming out right, but here it is. I think it looks so good right there, and it's probably the best spot to put it with how my room is set up. My hangers did come in, and I put the rest of my clothes up, mainly my skirts, and then it was finally time to put the LED lights up. So I wanted to put some behind my desk so I could have cute lights on while I work. So I used a shorter strip for that one, and this is how it ended up looking. I went with the purple light. I don't think they have pink, which kind of sucks, but oh well. And then I got these longer ones for the clothes rack, and girl, when I tell you this shit was heavy, it was so hard to move. Low-key, I was working up a sweat trying to pull this shit out so I could put the lights behind it, and 
and yeah low key i should have done this before i put everything on it but oh well i did that shit and it came out so cute and i'm so happy with them so this is pretty much the final look at the room with the lights off it's so cute such a vibe for when i'm just like chilling watching videos or editing so yeah i'm so happy it literally came out exactly how i pictured it Okay, so like I said, I was going to give you a little room tour in the end. So I'm actually going to start from outside the door. And we're going to fake open it. So I can show you guys how it looks when you first walk in. So I have my floating shelves right here. So a lot of stuff did come from my old room. So if you guys saw my old room tour, my other apartment, a lot of things are similar. So I did have this in my last room. I did get new boxes though. And pretty much here I have like my jewelry. It's like my like little accessories corner. I do have this little plush and my like pens. And I keep all my perfumes here as well. It is kind of a mess. But don't mind that so then here i have my sunglasses things from amazon i'll try my best to link everything so yeah the sunglasses little rack thingy from amazon i just put a few shades on there and then here is the plaque that we kind of diy'd or just like added stickers to i do have this little like key hook thingy and this hmm i think is from miniso it's really cute because like the little hello kitty could go in the strawberry or like when you pull it like she pops out so yeah i just keep my keys there so i don't lose them and then up there i just have things that i don't really like grab too often because girl i can barely reach so then over here is the closet so the closet pretty much is like the same as my old apartment like i did the whole like purse wall thing like i put them just on the command hook like these so i just got a bunch of command hooks put the purses on them and then here i just keep like my like winter jacket jackets and stuff or like heavier coats heavier hoodies like i have like all like my winter coats here then this kind of more like the lighter coats and then hoodies and um sets just because these are heavier so i didn't want to put the heavier things on the clothes rack then just we have the shoes down here i do have some shoe boxes still just because i don't want to get rid of these shoe boxes in case i want to sell these sneakers later on it makes it really easy to find what i'm looking for also how cute are these guys recent pickup up. i got them at second street so cute and then pretty much up there i just have like random shit that's that and then the mirror i didn't know if i wanted to put shit around the mirror or just keep this like clean look i feel like the vibe for this room is very much just like clean organized minimal with just like some like cute touches you know i do have a little cute rug just because i feel like the floor was so naked so i was like it needs something it might have been in like marshall's or tj maxx or one of those kind of places so so yeah it's just like a cute little pink fuzzy rug then here is the poster wall i'm contemplating if i want to add more posters and bring it all the way down to the floor i feel like that could be a vibe as it kind of just looks like like it looks incomplete so i'm just like hmm maybe we could use a little more posters i'm also thinking guys i kind of want to get a beanbag chair I feel like it would go perfectly right there. Imagine me just sitting here in a beanbag chair, chilling, vibing, and that way I can like watch the TV like while I'm editing or something. I feel like beanbag chair could be a vibe for like this little space. Cause it's like a big ass gap. I don't know what to do with it. We've made it to the clothes rack, the main event. I feel like everyone really fucks with the clothes rack. Like whenever I post it or whenever friends come over, they're just like, oh my God, this shit is so cute. So it really feels like I'm in like a little store. Like I feel like I'm in my own store like of just all my stuff so let's do a little tour okay so here i have my bigger bags i just keep them on i know they're called hangers i keep calling them hooks in the video guys but i don't think they're called hooks i think they're called hangers <laughs> so yeah i keep them on these hangers i love my bags i'm such a bag lady and i think they're very pretty so they literally are like art to me some bigger tote bags and stuff my shower cap is literally a hello kitty shower cap here i keep my hats so i have some like just like random knickknacks and shit like i have my ugh, can't reach it, polaroid camera and then i have this other like cutie little bag someone gifted me here i keep all my like keychains so sometimes i add 
add these to my purses just because I think they're super adorable. They make like a good accessory. Back here, I just have all my hats. They're all kind of lined up back here. I don't really wear hats as much lately. On the top, I keep the things that, one, they're cute and pretty and I like to display them. And then two, that don't fit anywhere else. So I have like this humongous like, Hello Kitty bag. My Chanel bag, which I think is really pretty. So I want to like put it on display. <laughs> my Telfizi, Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty. This stuff is like kind of ugly, just kind of more like storage type shit. So don't look at that. Ah! Oh my God, girl, I almost died. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have my speakers here and I brought my flowers from my last apartment. I ended up putting the Sailor Moon poster back here. And I just think it looks cute, like a cute little like wallpaper, like background. This is where I keep all my like girly things, you know, self-care things. Like my skincare's in here. I can show you guys, but kind of a mess. And like my hair stuff, gel, rays, and things like that. And then down here is just like filming equipment. So, okay. So this is how I organize the shelf, girl. So on this first tier i have all my baby tees so i do have like tanks here as well but mainly baby tees like i love baby tees so much i want to be a baby tee because they're just like my go-to here i have like my shorts and skirts once again i got these hooks from amazon girl i mean see i call them hooks again the hangers and then it goes into like the longer skirts in the back that goes into oopsie that goes into my jeans and other pants I I like really recommend this system for anyone in a New York apartment with high ceilings like I'm blessed to have high ceilings so I feel like vertical living is where it's at like vertical storage you know so I feel like I want to fill up the space to the ceiling and less like floor space to continue I have matching sets here I'm a matching set girly so I have a whole little section for them and then it goes into dresses little mini dresses then like the longer dresses that goes into my my jumpsuits and I have like my bigger tees so down here was just the baby tees so up here is like the bigger tees so yeah I have like the baby Milo tee I got this tee which is tee as well then we have our long sleeves oh I should wear this soon girl I don't know why I have so many fur vests but they have a whole section so i am a fur girly but fake fur only real fur kind of gives me the heebie-jeebies does it creep you guys out then we have like our light jackets so i have like this little blazer leather jacket leather jacket leather jacket and i just have ugh, my longer like cardigan cardigan backyardigans fluffy one this one is literally like to the floor like she is long girl yeah that's pretty much the whole system we have going on here and then it's my bed so i've been scrolling on tiktok trying to find like organization hacks or like how to make a small room look bigger or feel bigger and they're like girl go with the white sheets white sheets automatically make your room feel bigger lighter like more airy you know so i went with the light sheets because the best decision i ever made it's so cute it's not gonna lie these kind of suck they're kind of like a really cheap um kind of duvet thing but i feel like it gets the job done like it gives that like clean as aesthetic that I wanted like a little plant which this was also in my last apartment put up the pink curtain but the tv girl the floating tv yes she's it yeah she's just up there vibing we playing lo-fi hip-hop just for like the aesthetic visuals you know then the desk um pretty much same setup as in my last apartment definitely want a new chair this chair hurts my back so bad like it's just a terrible chair but yeah and then we're back over here i have gotten questions on like where i keep my wigs because i'm like a wig girly but pretty much i just keep them down here in their wig bags so like i have two you know drawers pretty much full of like wigs so i just keep them in their wig bag tuck them away here i don't know if that's a good way to store them but i mean it works for me i know we already passed this part but i kind of forgot to talk about it <laughs> i have my hats and kind of head accessories so like earmuffs hats headbands things like that and then in here i have like my sock oh these are dirty girl socks leg warmers tights and things like that so all my accessories are kind of tucked in here and then what do i have in here oh this is just like more hair stuff um like my hot tools and like bonnets and shit like that and then here is just like i mail in there because girl i hate mail <laughs> So I just keep it in there so I don't have to look at it. But yeah, that's pretty much the whole little makeover transformation, guys. Like, it's not crazy. It's not like a whole room transformation. Like, it's, you know, little things that just make it feel cuter. 
and like more organized which is what I wanted okay per guys so that was the whole little room tour I'm so sorry this video is like kind of chaotic and kind of all over the place but it took time for me to figure out like kind of what I wanted to do with this space kind of don't like this like film background I do like to film with natural lighting so I'm kind of like in front of the window but I feel like this background is kind of like snooze right like I feel like I should add something to it but I don't know what because it's just pretty much the two doors like what can I really put on there but um we'll figure it out and yeah thank you guys for watching this video shout out to natives for sponsoring this video and make sure to click the link in my description and definitely check them out it helps me and it helps the channel yeah thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe to your girl and i will be posting a lot more frequently from now on guys sorry i was down bad for a while you know i've been in school and internship and everything but oh yeah guys i didn't even tell you i have an internship now i have a styling internship Thank you guys for watching this video and I will talk to you guys in the next one.